Today I'm going to be watching Notts County versus Mansfield. Now Notts County have had a brilliant start to the season and they're in first place. However Mansfield are just four points behind and their local rivals so this is going to be a very tough game. So let's get to Meadow Lane. So as we walked into the stadium we could hear the 16,000 fans inside the stadium and the atmosphere was amazing throughout the game. So the two teams came out and the game was being showed on Sky Sports as well. So Mansfield started the game and County seized the first opportunity in the third minute of the game. It was Dan Crowley who smashed the ball past the keeper. But soon after, Mansfield started to get into the game and had their own chances. And then it was in the 24th minute when a mistake from County led to a Mansfield chance and the attacker slotted the ball past Slocum who was in goal. But it all went downhill from here for the Magpies. Mansfield kept creating chances but County managed to hang on. And towards the end of the first half the ball was whipped in for Langstaff at the other end of the pitch. However, it was a tough angle and the goalkeeper saved it on the line after a scramble. That ended the first half. But Mansfield carried on creating chances and pressuring County into the second half. And after several close efforts, Mansfield scored from a corner. Their fans went absolutely wild. And a few minutes later, they scored again from another corner, which rebounded out and a Mansfield player tapped it into the net. And very soon after, the Mansfield winger crossed the ball into a dangerous area in the box and the striker tapped the ball past Slocum to make it 4-1 to Mansfield. Towards the end of the game, County started to create some good chances, mainly coming from substitute Adebayo Rowling. However, it was too late. The whistle was blown, signalling the end of the match and three points for Mansfield. Maybe I'm being biased, but I thought that it wasn't as one-sided as the scoreline showed. Mansfield did have most of the chances, however I think that if County had scored that chance towards the end of the first half, then it could have been a totally different game. But this meant that Mansfield moved up to third, with County just one place above. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you next time.